Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel, and in today's video, I have some exciting news for you guys who are fans of The Walking Dead or fans of Rick Grimes in particular. Um, so, there are some rumors going on right now about Rick Grimes, you know, making his return and a potential announcement coming within the next few weeks regarding that. And I mean, that's just really exciting to hear as fans of The Walking Dead. I mean, obviously you have to take this with a grain of salt, but there's been, you know, multiple online sources talking about this and saying that this is going to happen. Um, even Portal The Walking Dead said, In the coming weeks, we will have an official announcement about the future of Rick Grimes in The Walking Dead universe. So, I mean, there's a lot of people talking about this right now, and there's so much hype and excitement with this. And that's just because The Walking Dead, The Ones Who Live, was such a big, successful show, right? I mean, it was absolutely fantastic. It's definitely, in my opinion, the best Walking Dead spinoff. Um, I think that it was just... I think just the quality of the show and seeing Rick and the story of Rick and Michonne and, and just how they how they did it, right? It just It just was really, really awesome. It was really, really great to see that. Um, so what does this mean exactly, right? An announcement about the future of Rick Grimes. Well, I mean, it could be anything, right? And, and technically it could be them saying that Rick's story is over, right? It could be them saying that Rick's story is done. What if over the last, you know, how long has it been since the ones who live ended like eight months or seven months or so? What if over the last eight months or so, Andrew Lincoln and Denai Guerrero and Scott Gimple have all been talking and discussing the future of Rick Grimes? And what if Andrew Lincoln just made the decision that he's done with the character and that he wants to move on with his life and do other things and isn't really interested in, you know, doing any more Rick Grimes stuff as of right now and, you know, maybe ever, right? Um, who knows? So, I mean, we have to kind of understand that that could be a potential outcome from this announcement, right? It could potentially be that, but I don't think that's going to be what it is. I honestly do believe it's going to be an announcement saying that Rick's story will continue in the Walking Dead universe, that Rick is going to be back again. And I think it's going to be a really exciting time. I really do hope that whatever they do next, they do it with the same amount of passion and the same budget that they did with The Ones Who Live, because man, The Ones Who Live was just so great to me. And I've rewatched it two times now. And I have to say, it's just almost better and better every time I watch it. It's funny because it had me feeling like the old days again. You know, it, it really did make me feel those same emotions I felt back during the Walking Dead original series. And I think it's just because Rick is so incredible. And Rick is definitely, I mean, him and Daryl are tied for me for my favorite Walking Dead characters. I mean, I absolutely love these characters, man. Um, so, anyways... With the announcement coming up soon, potentially, right, about Rick Grimes and his future, you know, if they do announce that Rick is going to be coming back, you know, is it going to be a new show? Is it going to be, you know, him making an appearance in Dead City or Daryl Dixon? Personally, in my opinion, guys, I don't think that it's going to be an announcement saying that Rick's going to be in Daryl Dixon Season 3 or Season 4 or something like that, or Dead City Season 3 or something like that. I don't see that happening. Um, if anything, I do think it's going to be them saying that Rick Grimes is going to be getting his own show uh, with Michonne and Judith and stuff like that and RJ. And maybe they could call it The Walking Dead Grimes, right? I mean, I think that that could be an interesting title for their show. Um, I don't really know. <laughs> it's just off the top of my head. But I don't think it's going to be an announcement saying that Rick's going to be joining other shows. I think Rick is way too big of a character. And I think Andrew Lincoln definitely would want his own kind of spotlight. I think he would want to, you know, have his own show. I don't think he wants to go join them. Um, if anything, you know, maybe they will bring back the Walking Dead original series or do a whole new The Walking Dead show with some of the original series characters and stuff like that. And Rick could be the leader. I think he would be down for that. Um, almost like a Walking Dead Part 2, uh, maybe with Ezekiel and Eugene and Mercer and, you know, Lydia and stuff like that. I mean, that would be really cool. Um, I don't necessarily think that's going to happen either, though, but I think there's a better chance for that than, you know, him joining Daryl Dixon or joining Dead City. I don't think that's even really possible. I don't think that's going to happen at all. Um, but yeah, it's going to be something exciting, you know, if it's actually true, if they actually do announce something in the next few weeks, you know, regarding Rick Grimes and his future, uh, just because, man, I mean, Rick is such a great character. We need to see more, and it's funny because when The Ones Who Live ended, right, during that last episode, I was really nervous all throughout because I just didn't really know what was going to happen in terms of 
Rick's story and Rick's future, if he was going to die, if he was going to live. I didn't really know because I had been hearing that The Ones Who Live was only going to be one season and stuff like that, but all these other Walking Dead spinoffs are getting multiple seasons and stuff. So I was thinking in my head, like, wait, is Rick going to die? I mean, there's no way, right? I mean, and obviously he didn't and everything, but that level of intensity, right? That's what we need in The Walking Dead universe. And man, Andrew Lincoln brings that every single time. He's fantastic. He's one of the best actors I've ever seen in my life. And I need more Rick Grimes in my life. I just do. I'm not done with Rick Grimes. I'm not done with the Walking Dead universe. I'm still a really, really big fan of this universe and of this show. Um, But yeah, I mean, I need to see more Rick. He's an absolutely incredible character. And Andrew Lincoln, one of my favorite actors of all time. So... I think that we have a lot of really exciting stuff to look forward to, guys. I mean, obviously, keep your eyes peeled over the next few weeks for, you know, big announcements from AMC or Scott Gimple regarding Rick Grimes and everything like that. And obviously, you guys know if there's any announcements, I will go over them and cover them with you all. So be sure to be subscribed to the channel and drop a like and everything like that if you want to see more Walking Dead stuff like this because... All throughout the Walking Dead off-seasons, I'm going to keep you guys updated with any news and rumors regarding the Walking Dead universe because I still love this universe, and I know there's plenty of people out there who still love it as well that want to be you know, kept up to date with uh, all the rumors and all the news and everything like that. So be sure to be subscribed to the channel um, if you guys are interested in that. Um, but very quickly, before I end the video, because I am going to wind it down here in a minute, um, I did just finish watching The Walking Dead Daryl Dixon Season 2 finale, and I'm going to be making a review on that soon. Um, I'm probably going to be doing that Monday or Tuesday because I kind of want to give people a chance to watch it um, before you know I make my review and everything. But I will say it was a good episode, but it definitely did not live up to the hype in my opinion. Um, and that episode really made me realize, like, okay, The Ones Who Live is a better show than Daryl Dixon, right? Like, Daryl Dixon is still a great show. I like it a lot. But The Ones Who Live was really special, man. Those six episodes, man, holy smokes. Those were incredible. Uh, seeing Rick again, there's something special about Rick Grimes, bro. There just is. And, yeah, I, I mean, that episode of Daryl Dixon definitely, in my opinion, made it very clear for me anyway that The Ones Who Live is a better show. And um, it's not that Daryl Dixon sucks or anything. I still love Daryl Dixon. I'd give it like an 8.5 out of 10 probably or 8.3 out of 10 overall as a show. It's just the ones who live for me was just dang near perfect. I, I just loved it so much. And I think we need Rick Grimes back in the Walking Dead universe on a regular basis. So like I said, please be sure to drop a like and subscribe. I'll keep you guys up to date with everything regarding The Walking Dead and, you know, obviously any rumors or news. And this was a really big deal. A lot of people are talking about this right now. So, yeah, we'll just keep our eyes peeled over the next couple weeks for any news regarding Rick Grimes. And, yeah, it's going to be very exciting if they do announce a new spinoff featuring Rick Grimes and Michonne and Judith and RJ and everything. I mean, it's going to be awesome, guys. So, I will see you guys in the next video. Make sure you stay safe out there in the crazy world, man. And, oh, and also... Click the link down below in the description if you guys want to get some Dr. Squatch for a crazy discount. Um, I have a link referral code down below in the description. And if you guys click the link down below and go shopping for some Dr. Squatch, you'll get some crazy good discounts and stuff like that. There's no reason to smell bad in 2024. Um, trust me, guys. Dr. Squatch is the best in the game. Be sure to check it out. I love you guys. Stay safe out there in the crazy world. Peace out.